Hi there! This is Al from GamingGeek.net and we've got another Retroid Pocket 3 Plus performance test for you guys. Another requested game. This is a Fight Night Round 3. Uh, the PAL version that was originally released on the PlayStation 2. There you go. And um, before we let the, the game play out, uh, let's go ahead and take a look at the settings that I'm going to be starting with. All right, so here we have under system, cycle rate, I put it at 75 already. Cycle skip will do mild underclock. Nothing else changed for graphics. Uh, nothing else changed for audio. We're gonna do a Gaussian for interpolation mode and then time stretch for synchronization mode. And that's about it. Now the opening movie uh, doesn't, Play well. I mean, it says 100% on the upper right, but it's like choppy. But you're not gonna play this this game on the record pocket three plus to watch this movie, right? It's not. This isn't very important. So we'll go ahead and skip that. Now we're gonna load uh, my save file and do it quick. All right, one second. All right, I had to uh, change the settings and uh, get rid of the licensed music in the background. So uh, we're just going to do silence right, and sound effects for this game. Um, now, Fight Night Round 3, uh, what are we going to do? There are a couple of um, modes here, uh, but let's do a Play Now Round. So we'll be in the blue corner and there's a couple of um, choices here. I think you choose your weight class and then you choose your uh, boxer. So here, who do we have in featherweight? We have uh, a Manny Pacquiao here and a different version of Manny Pacquiao, the one that I have in training mode. Let me just uh, lighten things up. Let's see if there's a lightweight Manny Pacquiao. No. All right, we'll do the, oops. I'm gonna choose Manny as my um, character because, well, And then we're going to do a Manny versus Oscar de la Hoya match. And we're going to do Windy City Boxing Gym. And I don't, I forgot if we, I was able to change the difficulty. So we're just going to do uh, a match, go directly into it. So we can see how it performs. In case you have the same settings that I showed you and uh, performance isn't as good, you may need to do the sleep mode trick because I did that earlier. What is the sleep mode trick? Just put your device in sleep mode for 20 to 30 seconds. And then wake it and then play. In my previous videos, I've shown differences between performance. Alright. Oops. All right, so we do see a bit of a stutter. Whenever that happens, uh, it's time to adjust the settings. All right, this isn't good. All right, let's see. I'm not sure why. You know, to fight a power like this, you gotta try to stay on the outside, getting in 
Oh, wow. So there was a bit of a performance issue when we started the, the mat bout, but now we're... Uh, Now it's actually playing pretty well. Alright, this is a slugfest. All right, quite intense. I think we are in easy mode. All right, that's round one. We'll skip the replay. Okay, let's listen to the coach. Now that is weird because he's bloodied and all. But the um, coach, his coach, thinks that he's winning. All right.
right now is an intense trying to keep my device within frame one more minute We've almost got the La Jolla. Okay. So replays are not playing well, so we'll skip that. Now yeah, let's finish the, the match. All right, let's skip that. I think we have uh, De La Hoya. We're gonna get a knockdown this round, I hope. It's really intense. One minute. Oh, there you go. Man, I got excited. I haven't been going for the kill. Did we break a rib? It sounded like... Sounded like a rib craft or something like that. 
All right, our first knockdown of the match. Round four. How much did uh, De La Hoya heal up? I wonder if we will be able to get another knockdown this round. Alright, two minute mark. Alright, another knockdown. That's our second knockdown for the match. One minute mark. Oh, wow. Okay. That's our third knockdown of uh, De La Hoya. Yeah, skip that. Okay, skipping all the coaching sequences, we don't care. De La Hoya's uh, health meter is already low to start, so I think we can knock him down twice this round. All right, another knockdown. I 
I don't think he's gonna recover a bunch of health. So it's up to us to take advantage. I'm almost there. Oh. There you go. I think this will do it, but let's see. He's taking such a beating. Wow. No, there you go. All right, knockout in seven rounds. I think, is that the seventh round? All right, so we'll skip leave fight. And that is um, a full match. Uh, of, of course, it is an easy mode, just wiping this down. So we're gonna check out some other modes. ESPN Classic Career Mode Game Modes. Let's take take a look at that. Hard Hits. I don't know what this is. Who are our heavyweights? Ali Holyfield. Alright, so we'll choose Muhammad Ali. And it's like they have their versions of there you go. So we're doing um, Ali versus uh, Holyfield. We'll do the Aragon Ballroom. So we won't finish this one, just take a look at uh, how a round goes. A hard hit fight does not have round timer. Sounds are decided by knockouts. The boxer with the, oh okay, so hard hits. There's no time. All right, no timers. These are all, this is all just punching. Knockdowns. Ooh, wow. No belt to save Holyfield from what I'm going to do to him. Ooh. Got him with a trademark punch. So this is more of a fighting game.
There you go. I'm struggling to get the device to stay in frame. All right, so a round ends when someone is knocked down. Swiping it down. All right, I hate seeing smudges uh, in the screens of my uh, gaming devices. Oh, look at that almost uh, full. Wow. That wow. Yep, and I'm a really good intense game. Performance is okay. I am having fun, even though I'm not a big boxing fan. Nope. Man, if I had connected with a trademark punch there. Oh, wow. I originally said that we're not going to finish this, but you know, this is m much faster than a regular match. So let's, let's finish it. We're now in round three. Ooh, wow, look at that. Uh, Holyfield is doing his best to survive. I'm getting a little anxious because he's right there in the edge. I can do this. He's already dizzy. That's correct. It was a good job.
Having trouble finishing Holyfield off. Oh wow. There you go, man. That was a trademark punch from Muhammad Ali. Wow, this is... He's a tough uh, opponent. Uh, Holyfield's a really tough opponent, so... I'm gonna reserve my trademark punches. Got, I got in three punches there. Two extra punches after he got his uh, knockdown punch. So he's uh, really stretching Holyfield. Round five. You should be quick. Holyfield's health isn't that high. That was quick of him to dodge that. Ah, uh, here's another grab, man. Stop grabbing me. There you go. That punch penetrated the defense of uh, Holyfield. Wow, it's like... like uh, What the better move is manual heal or automatic heal but we had to try that at least once all right There you go, that's a solid shot. And this is the... Yeah, 
it's it's so we'll do auto heal wow holy field is really like hanging on this is round seven i've knocked him down six times There you go. Kick him, kick him. <laughs> Alright, finally he's not making a motion to stand up. Alright. Okay, and that is hard hits. Leave fight. Now just take a. I think this game is uh, performing well. Training. What do we have here? I don't want to do the combo dummy, heavy bag, weight lifting, sparring. Real sparring. We, we all know how that's going to be. I'll do weightlifting because I'm not good at targeting uh, areas with the uh, right analog stick so we're gonna skip that uh, training bag what are the instructions here We're not supposed to go beyond the... Yeah. Throwing the towel. Sparring is just sparring. This one's just um, hitting the combo dummy for a combination punch. Yeah, you know what? Let's just see how it plays, but we're not gonna finish it. Where's the. There, see, it's uh, looks It's just that I think that that needs a little bit of mastery of the game of mastering how to punch, how to control your punches using the right analog stick. Something I'm not gonna, you know.
There you go. So those are the. We're not gonna go into sparring because sparring's just you know. The same with the regular match. So those are the other three training modes. And the last mode that we're gonna get into, to them training hard hits, is create champ. Let's see how fast it plays. New boxer. So we're gonna do uh, first and last. The assassin, he's gonna be. I don't know, just for flushing queens. Start. And so, uh, L1, R1, so we're gonna. Southpaw. Uh, yeah, we'll do. What's this? Mummy. Power. Speed. We'll do wild. Punch style. Slugger. We have other things. Yeah, fast. Blockstar Classic. Alright. We'll do, yeah, Welterweight's fine. Um, um what do we do i don't know exactly how to adjust this but okay okay oh okay that's how it works all right very interesting way of um doing a uh, character creation I don't even see how how many points we have remaining Let's first start, accept changes. Alright, so we have first, last, and then finally, I mean, in terms of the controlling create champ, there's no issues. Um, so we will go to career mode, and we just want to see how, how it starts, and we're going to wrap this up. Oh, oh, wait a second, where, where am I? Fight, fight story. I think I already have my uh, career mode. I think it's Manny. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, career mode uh, for me is a little bit boring actually. Because you do some training, you do some, you, you level your uh, fighter up. So this version of Manny isn't the same version that you get to play in the exhibition modes. Alright, we'll skip the entrances. That's weird. There, see? Manny's like, oh, much slower than how he is. Uh, from from exhibition barely doing any damage I think that uh, we've seen enough of Fight Night Round 3 to conclude that it plays well on the Retro Pocket 3 Plus. I didn't even change anything. Uh, what did I do? Oh yeah, I only put it on 75% uh, cycle rate and uh, mild underclock uh, for cycle skip. And everything else is pretty much the default. Yeah.
All right, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. Uh, I've done a video on Fight Night Round 2 as well as Rock Legends. Uh, you, that might be interesting to you guys too. And uh, anyone who has uh, requested games, let me know and I'll add it to the list. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to test that soon. Uh, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Once again, this is Al from GamingGeek.net. Talk to you in the next video.